Melanie from Melanie Ann Home Life. Tim! Donut face. I wanted to document what I'm going to eat today going out because I'm back on the keto. Let's get into it. As you see, the jerks in this car have donuts. Damn those jerks. And colas. And we're drinking colas. Ugh. Cola. Okay, so I, yeah, cola. So I have not been on a date out like this since, uh, nope, can't say that, that word. Uh, I haven't been out on a day like this since before March, one, because of surgery, two, because the world. Uh, so I've had a lot of feedback from people about how I eat keto and asking me to do keto recipes again. And so I wasn't going to go back on keto for a while, but I decided to jump back on that keto train. How's that doing for you, Tim? <laughs> I love it. Yeah, Tim's not doing keto. <laughs> but all the keto meals that I make are generally just meals that I make in a keto form and these guys just eat them. So my sides may be different, but theirs are not. The mains are the same. Yeah. The so, sides are different. So like, for example, if I make a keto meatloaf, I make a keto meatloaf. These guys eat it. They what? Don't... The meatloafs are keto? Yes! And they, <laughs> they don't know the difference. So what I actually do is I just make it so I can eat it. Look at Addison's shocked. Addison's like, what, I've been eating keto all this time? Yeah, except you eat the pasta and I eat the mung bean noodle. So. It's pronounced dung bean noodle. Yeah, Timmy, Timmy eats mung bean noodles and I am obsessed with them. So I thought today's a great day. We are doing a shopping trip to the outlets in Niagara Falls. And I decided this was gonna be a day where I ate out the whole day. So, I want you to know, I get these little babies, Ooh. ratio bars. I get them at Costco. Uh, they are nine grams of carbs and three grams of fiber. So, six net carbs, but they're really good. They taste like a, a, nutri a nature valley bar, like a dry nature valley bar. So, I have that in my purse uh, in case I get hungry, but usually I don't. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna also show you I have a premier protein shake in my Yeti that I am gonna drink before I get to the mall and I've went to Tim Hortons and bought a double espresso it's like time for me to break my fast anyways so I've also picked what time is it? it's almost 12 oh so I've also picked up from Tim Hortons two sausage patties and cheddar cheese so this is what I'm gonna have right now. I'm gonna have my shake, the sausage patties, and uh, the espresso. And that's gonna be my first meal today. I did have a coffee a little while ago because it's Saturday and I just wanted to. So I'm gonna devour and then I'm gonna show you where we end up and who we pick up along the way on this journey. Here, what are you doing? Marshalls. It's kind of weird. 
so shopping was a little unique, very uh, interesting, lineups, 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 but they moved fast and it was good. So it's like 3.56 now, we're waiting for Papa and Daddy to come out of the liquor store, and uh, I'm not really hungry yet, like, Addison is starving, I am not, still satisfied from the breakfast. We'll be back. Okay, so we made a stop on our way back from our shopping adventure for dinner. If you live in Southern Ontario, like Hamilton, Brantford, wherever, there is a place on the Six Nations Reserve called The Burger Barn. The Burger Barn is run, it's, it's on the res reservation. There's a gas station on one side, a smoke shop on the other, so it's a win-win if you need gas or you smoke. Um, but otherwise the food here is superb this video is not sponsored by the burger barn um, they are not open inside yet and this is actually the first time we have been to a restaurant since everything went down in march so we are sitting outside because they have lovely patio tables and we've all ordered dinner and our dinner will be coming very very soon and i will show you what i ordered it's still keto friendly so, dinner. I did use some real ketchup. Where's my sides? I ate the tomatoes because I was so hungry. Caesar salad. Boom! Kept your keto. <laughs> That's called <laughs> charm. <laughs> Don't choke, Addison. <laughs> Here we are, end of the day. Did a full day of shopping. Had a great dinner. I stayed keto. Tim, ice cream. No, thank you. Addy? No, thank you. Yeah, I think we're all full. You know what? It is such a different world now. I, I have to tell you. And, uh. Don't talk about it. it <laughs> don't talk about it. It, it was, doesn't exist unless you talk about it. It doesn't exist unless you talk about it. Um, it was an interesting day, interesting afternoon out, and. I still eat keto. How many carbs did you have today, Bill? Uh, I think it, I think it was like around twenty, like around nineteen or twenty. The most carb I had today would have probably been my shake. My co my protein plus and uh, my coffee. And uh, I have to tell you. Can, can I just say something? One thing about how good Yeti thermoses are. Um, Mel had, we did that at noon, or 11 o'clock, Mel put the ice in this. There's still half a cup of ice in here. I don't know if it's in there. At 8.30 in the it's, evening. Yeah, 8.30. So, it, I know, it's insane. We honestly have had a good day, good break. Tune in tomorrow when we have Messy Jesse clean her room. <laughs> that would be an awesome video. Come clean with me video. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we would have to fast forward it a lot though because it would be four days. You would have to watch, like, it would be four full days of video. Anyways, I'm Melanie. I'm Tim. I'm Messy Jesse. Messy Jesse. And we are from Melanie and Home Life. Hope you enjoyed a day in our life. Yeah, and Peace. don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. How are you feeling about them? I like them. I love you. <laughs>